Hi, I'm Thelma of Seasonal Crafts and Creations, and welcome back to my channel, and welcome if you're new. Today, I will be showing you how to reuse something from Easter, this planter I used at Easter, and the flowers I used on a wreath at Easter, and the Spanish moss and the foam that was in it. I used, all I did was take out the the uh, egg sticks that I had on, and I'm reusing the whole thing, the whole planter. So all you have to do is get your flowers, pull them off of your wreath, and stick them down all the way from mid front, all the way around back, and then use any of your fairy garden stuff if you have from a previous fairy garden and or you can go to the Dollar Tree on your next trip and buy them. You can buy three fairies in a pack for a dollar. You can buy a snail, um, an owl, and one other thing for a dollar. And you can buy three gnomes for a dollar. And they have a bird, a bunny, and a baby deer for a dollar. And all you have to do is set them where you want to set them. Let me get these back on here and I'll turn it around again so you can see it. And then once you got them set where you want to set them, you just start gluing them in. There's one more time for you to look at it and I'm going to set it at an angle so you can see. Make sure your glue gun is hot and you have um, glue sticks available. First I'm going to start off with the little deer. Put a generous amount of glue on the bottom. Make sure you have it for the heads turning forward or you have it on backwards. Let me turn this around just a little so I can get to the stuff. And push down on it to where it holds place when you let go of it. And this is made since you're reusing everything. About four dollars. Got a little glue on the bunny head, so I got to get it off. There. Now we will do the bunny. I need some more glue. Do the bunny. Now do your um, gnome, since it's far back there, in the back under the roses and the ivy. Yeah, I forgot. I put uh, two stings, stems of ivy in there. I just snipped them off the wreath and cut off one end for over here and one for right here in the center. You can add more ivy if you want. It's really your it's really up to you what kind and how much that you use.
Got to redo the. It didn't take. Make sure you push down. And now the last one is the little bird. And I fluffed up the um, Spanish moss around where the little red bird's sitting to make it look like she's in, sitting in her little nest. Let me turn this around so I can show you what it looks like. Give you a good close-up view. And that's what I'm talking about, the flowers on each side. And I used the one that I painted white and used the farmhouse method of the paint. Just dab it a little bit and go sideways. And it's called Burnt Umber is the color of the brown. All right. I want to thank you all for joining me. And be sure to subscribe to my channel if you like this. And y'all have a good day. Goodbye.